What's up? Um, so I thought today I didn't really have much to do because my pivot still ain't working. So I thought, why not play some Undertale? So. Now I have actually beat this quite a few times, so I'll have to restart. This will probably end up being like a, like a playlist, kinda. So, uh, if you want me to do the next bit of it, uh, if we can get to 10 likes, I will do the next recording of it. And if I can get to 15, that I will even do um, another post today. I'm just making sure that the audio isn't on. I want uh, the music to be drowning out everything. I think that's better. Is that better? I can't really tell, so... Hopefully that's okay. <laughs> Sorry I missed it all. <laughs> also, if you're wondering why I'm not, like, as, like, bright jumping around with my voices just woke up and I'm trying to edit a few videos so I've never actually edited before uh, so uh, I'm just gonna reset I want to change my name but I don't seem to have Hmm. So yeah, I'm Kara. I kind of just, I don't know how I felt like it. So, don't you have anything better to do? Because I've fought before. So normally he would be like, oh, are you new around here? But, um, I've done it before. So, your soul starts off weak, but you can grow strong if you gain lots of LV. What's LV stand for? Why, love, of course. No, it doesn't. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Love, down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around, get as many as you can. Hey buddy, you missed them. Let's try again, okay? Oh, sorry, I'm just, I'm just really bad at this. Yeah, I'm brain dead. Bullets! Friendliness pellets. You see the way he changed it? <laughs> He's my favourite character, apart from the classics. You know what's going on here, don't you? So in the first bit, uh, the first time you ever play, this is the first thing you basically fight. So you wouldn't have any clue not to run into it, and you'd just run into it and he'd say, like, basically, you're so stupid and try and fight you. But since I've played it before, uh, he knows that basically there's this... It's kind of like a time time continuum, kind of. So every time you restart your game, a flurry knows that you've reset it. So he has to sit and do this monologue every single time so he gets annoyed so he so instead of saying why do you like why aren't you running into it why why do you not know and then he's saying you know what's going on here don't you so just a really cool thing that he added right well yeah i think i'm gonna
I can't make this fam fam family friendly, uh, kid friendly, can I? Because this is not alive. What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Ah, do not be afraid, my child. I am Torio, caretaker of the runes. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. <laughs> I know I have really bad voices for this. I have a pretty good papyrus and sans, I think. I don't know. But, yeah. This way. Let me just save real quick. The shadow of the ruins looms above, filling you with determination. HP fully restored. I'm coming, goat mom. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. The ruins are full of puzzles, ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. I have adjusted. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labelled the ones that you need to flip. Stay on the path. Uh, also, if I don't read all of those things, sorry, I just really can't be bothered with it. I like to just get on with the story. Now, something funny that Goat Mom does. No, no, no. You want to press the other switch. I even labelled it for you. She thinks we're stupid now. <laughs> Splendid. I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. Sorry, I'm going to have to fight you, goat mom. As a, living, as a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. Oh, wait. If you're new to Undertale and you don't really know this, to the three viewers watching my YouTube channel, I will put in the title that this has slight, um, what do you call it, spoilers. <sighs> <sighs> you will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time, and I will come and resolve the conflict. <laughs> Practice talking to the dummy. Sorry if I feel like I sound raspy or anything. I'm just not really feeling well. You've encountered the dummy. No, 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 no. I don't want to fight. Don't want to fight. Don't want to fight. Don't want to fight. You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. Toriel seems happy with you. You won! Earned zero EXP and zero gold. Ah, very good! You are very good! Anyways, there's another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Frog boy. There's the frog boy. Frog, it attacks you! I need to threaten him. And Toriel, I've been threatened. <laughs> I love that scene. Well, <sighs> the western room is the eastern room's bleep blueprint. I don't know east and west, so that's kind of useless to me. Oh yeah, that's one.
What if Toriel forgets the way? Will she just get a spike through her foot? Also, I love her art. She looks so cute and sweet and innocent. Like, look at that. Uh, oh, sorry, I have buried that. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like it if I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. And then she is so freaking fast that the second she goes off screen, gone. I think he had, uh, Toby actually slowed me down during this. Also, if you don't know who Toby is, Toby Fox is the person that made Undertale. But I highly doubt anyone will not know that because no one is dumb. Now, one thing I'm going to say. Me walking like this, yeah, she's invisible for me right here. But if I was standing here, I would just see her standing behind the pillar. So, <laughs> hi. <laughs> She's just like, oh. There we go. Greetings, my child. Do not worry. I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Thank you for trusting me. Yeah, and also your big fat ass stuck out so much I could see you. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your um, independence. I must attend to some business. And you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It is dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? So... Now, this is the part where I normally make the decision to just continue going. But you can just stay here and then Toriel does come and pick you up. I have actually never done that option because I'm not very patient. So I'll try and do it, but if I get impatient, I will just leave. <laughs> I'm pretty sure... You Everyone is already invested in, like, the story by now. Um, this is, if you don't know, all the dialogue that I hear about the character, like, the Froggit has no clue what you're saying, but he was scared anyway. Uh, he was scared anyway because Kara's ghost follows me. Because when I fell, Kara was buried on the patch of flowers, so when I fell, she got permanently bound to me. So now, wherever I go, she has to explain to me and such and such. So, uh, he, it's sort of like my own uh, subtitles, technically. She, she scared him and I was fine. Uh, and then she's also saying like, um, the frog, it was scared anyway. So... I really love that touch. Uh, also, this was where she used to just sit here and draw while she was waiting for Toriel, her mother. <laughs> I've actually, I've made it to the Azrael ending, but I wasn't able to beat it, so I restarted to try and get some other endings. I made it to the Sans ending, and I beat Sans, and then I made it to Asgore. Um, but I couldn't beat Asgore, so I reset it again. And then I went to try and do other ones, but I haven't actually been able to do, like, Flurry Ending or... Um, Wait, no, I haven't got an Azrael ending. I haven't got that. The two flowery endings I wasn't able to get, sadly. So, well, actually, they're the same ending. Uh, the, I haven't been able to get to Azrael and then get to when Flowey turns into the big robot monster thing. Yeah. But hopefully Goat Mom calls soon. 
but I'm gonna call her. Oh my god, what was the button again? <laughs> what was the button? <laughs> Hold on. There we go, it was control. Got it. Uh, cell. Call her mum. Dialing. This is Toriel. Huh? Did you just call me mum? Well, I suppose. Would that make you happy? To call me mother? Well then, call me whatever you like. Click. And then we also have... Say hello. This is Toriel. You only wanted to say hello? Well then. Hello. I hope that suffices. <laughs> And what? Why didn't say hello? Go away. That's fine. We have to do it for it to continue. Huh? Oh. Uh. He 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 he. How adorable! I could pinch your cheek. You can certainly find a better old, better than an old woman like me. This is Toriel. You want to know more about me? Well, I'm afraid there's not much to say. I'm just a silly, a silly little lady who worries too much. No, you're not. You're the prince. You're the queen, and you divorced the king, and you had two children that both died brutally. Anyways. <laughs> Nah, bitch, I can't wait. I'm leaving. Hello, this is Torio. You've not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that I am yet to I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try and solve them yourself. Be good. Uh? I know I could have just sat there when it got some food and then just edited that out later, but I could not be bothered. <laughs> I just want to continue the game. Hello, little froggit. I want to fight you. I want you to die. <laughs> I'm probably going to try and go for the true pacifist ending. Hopefully that doesn't ruin it. The fact that I just um, hit him. If it does, please tell me in the comments. But if it doesn't, then yeah. How long have I been recording for? Hold on. Mm, okay. I might have to cut it here. Um, I know I haven't done much, but... Uh, I, since I haven't done much, I'll get two videos out in one day. But I'll do another one later. Um, if we get to 10 likes, I'll do another Undertale one. If not, I'll try and get an animation. Right. Let me just quickly end this and then save again. Right. Alright. Goodbye.